Okay, so recently I was asked by someone to purchase a budget portable speaker on behalf of that someone. The budget was set around 1000 rupees. Now, I am a JBL Co user for quite a long time and I was quite happy with the sound quality, especially for the size and the price they come for. However, that's a quite a old speaker and it was also shooting the budget. So, I did some research and logged onto the one of the most popular options available. Mivi Rome 2. Now I have used the original Mivi Rome and I was quite impressed with the sound quality. So without any hesitation, I ordered it. But after listening to it, I was kind of disappointed. More details in a bit, but I could not possibly recommend that to someone, especially if they have trusted with their money. So I did some more digging and found out about this particular speaker soundcore icon mini now shockingly there was not much reviews available both on youtube and also from the customer side so i was kind of hesitant to purchase that but based on my previous experience with soundcore i decided to go ahead with it and after listening to it i am quite surprised that how come this thing has gone unnoticed by so many people anyway in this video i am going to compare two of the most popular budget portable speaker with a not so popular one hey everyone my name is parth you're watching infopel and let's roll the intro. Okay, so the build quality of all these speakers are really good. Mivi being the only speaker which has metal mesh in front of it, but that does not mean that it is particularly better built than other two, just because JBL Co and Soundcore Icon Mini has plastic mesh at the front. Now all the three speakers have soft rubber touch at the sides, which helps them to grip the surface better, with Mivi being the only speaker which also has additional four rubber feet. Now gripping the surface none of these speakers struggles with, however, Yes, Soundcore Icon Mini will fall down if there is a little bit of shake on the surface and that is mainly due to its overly design. Now JBL Go does not come with any kind of IP rating but Soundcore Icon Mini and Mivi Round 2 both has IP rating for water resistance. But if you ask me, the overall build quality is nothing to choose from among these three. Now on the endurance part, JBL Co is the quickest of the lot with 4 to 5 hours of playback time. Depending on the volume, Soundcore Icon Mini sits in the middle with 8 hours of playback time. Now considering the size of this speaker, I feel that's quite decent. But both these speakers nowhere close to Mivi Rome 2. In fact, if you add both of their playback time, it will still lose by quite a margin. Mivi Rome 2 has 24 hours of playback time and they are not joking. In the limited time it was with me, I could not kill it and I have played more than 10 hours. So if marathon battery life is something that you are wishing for, then Mivi Rome 2 is your choice. Now one thing is common between all these three speakers, they all charges through micro USB cable and that's quite the standard at this price range for this kind of speaker. I hope that it changes soon but it is what it is. Now connection wise JBL has Bluetooth 4.1, Soundcore Icon Mini has Bluetooth 4.2 and Mivi Rome 2 has Bluetooth 5.0. However connection strength wise if you are keeping the speakers close to you they will work just fine. However with Bluetooth 5.0 Mivi Rome 2 will definitely have an edge especially on the connection distance. Now none of these speakers support dual pairing however both Soundcore Icon Mini and Mivi Rome 2 has a feature with which you can pair another set and make a stereo connection. Now 
Now let's talk about the sound quality and this is where Movie Rome 2 disappointed me. I was a big fan of original Movie Rome and I was quite impressed with the sound quality it had. Unfortunately Movie Rome 2 lacks that composure especially at the top volumes. It distorts and it also suffers in the bass frequency. It feels a little muddy and soft. Now Soundcore Icon Mini also does not have a very punchy bass but at least it is clean. If you are looking for a little punchy bass then JBL Co is still best among these these three speakers but don't expect earth shattering bass from any of these speakers. Volume wise also Mivi struggles compared to both these speakers with Soundcore Icon Mini having the best output of the lot. Also where Soundcore Icon Mini shines is in the vocals. They are even better than JBL Co. Be it stripped music or podcast or in general YouTube videos, Soundcore Icon Mini will sound the best. And also this is where Mivi Roam 2 actually struggles. It sounds really harsh at the high mids and kind of irritating. Also if you are like me who listens to a lot of old classical music then you should skip Movie Rome too. Ok final thoughts. If you care about sound quality you should choose Soundcore Icon Mini. It is also the cheapest of the lot and at that price it is a serious contender. I won't suggest you to buy Movie Rome 2 especially after what I heard. In fact if you find the original Movie Rome at a discounted price somewhere I would prefer you to buy that one instead. If you want a tad bit more punchy bass then you can go for JBL Co. But again for the price they come for they offer a lot less. They sure has become the thing of the past. Buy it only if you get it under 1000 rupees. Ok, I'll leave you there. That's all for this video. Leave your suggestions and queries in the comment section below. Until next time, this is Path signing off from InfoPal. I'll see you in the next one and you guys stay safe, stay strong.